All right, guys. Born a Hawkeye. What's up? What does kafefe mean? I made a video about this. Kafefe. Kafifi. What does it look like? I have a commenter here named Harry Love, and he gave me some constructive criticism back when I had a phone that wasn't as good and the microphone wasn't as, as good. Now, they're not allowing me, like, for, he didn't, I didn't get a notification for any of his, his messages, which happens a lot. Some people are getting sent to spam. But, um, so he says, please get yourself a, and I take all constructive criticism. Um, please get yourself a DS or, or a microphone not made of shredded wheat. <laughs> the other phone I had before was pretty bad. The audio is unbearable and this is such important information. Please. Now this video that I was on was about what did Trump's kafefe tweet mean? Like what it actually meant. And now it goes into, I'll put a link in the description of my kafefe video about, uh, about what I think it actually meant or, uh, like similar hints because he actually held up the bottle of the Fiji, the Fiji water bottle before the sex trafficking organization was busted in Fiji. And it's almost like he knows in the tech. What did his tweet say? His tweet said, his tweet said, um, what did it say? It said the media is all worried about this when they're like Kofefe. So what I'll get, what I gathered from that is he's talking about Kofifi and all these like celebrities and uh, politicians going to Thailand. Now, Thailand has been known for trafficking Ildren and X trades with Ildren for a long time. I knew that because my geography teacher in like, I think it was like seventh or eighth grade. I don't know. I, I found him kind of suspect, like the way he looked at me all the time. It was kind of weird, but, uh, he told me and he told the whole class that you could just go to Thailand and, you know, you could do it, do that with, you know, Ildren. And um, I thought that I was like, wow, you know, he seems like he has some firsthand knowledge about this. Like, uh, why have you been there so much, Mr. Henderson? So, yeah, so that happened. But um, so look at this. So I'm talking to this guy. And I said, sorry, I'm, uh, I'm, this is from my smartphone until I make enough money off YouTube AdSense to edit or PayPal until I get a computer. Thanks for your care and comment. I had a laugh. He said, yeah, I'm glad you know the comment isn't malicious. I can help you with a gift, good or software tools or audio tips if needed. Also had the misfortune of stating, in, I also had the misfortune of staying in Patia by Pat. Patong Beach and fled after the grim realization I was surrounded by pedos there to take advantage of kids. The place is saturated. So this guy left, or this person left, because the realization of how bad the pedophile actions are going on in Thailand, which everybody knows about now. P.S. Patong is in Fuck It. Fifi is an island close by. Fuck it. Anyway, your theory really makes sense in context of human trafficking and how the cabal use it all, set it all up. Who decides the age of consent laws there in all countries? That's a question that isn't asked enough. And I think I probably went into the video. This video is like a year old. Uh, consent laws, uh, how Ruth Bader Ginsburg, who's probably dead for some reason, they want to keep act like she's alive. Um, sorry, but you fall and you break your ribs. If you ever broken your ribs before, it ain't fun and you ain't healing with it. When you got some cancer at that age, you're not healing. So I told him, thank you, you know, and I wasn't getting any notifications for these. I just go through my comments and, and I'm looking. So, so watch this, ready? Please get yourself. Okay. So I love the comment unloved. Oh, now it wants to love. Now it wants to love. Hold on. Hold on. I swear to God, it was just unloved. Every single time I did it three times. All right. Okay, now it wants to... All right, you know what? Whatever. That's very, very strange. I swear to God, I've loved this comment. I even made a comment about it. I said, I've loved this like three different times. It wouldn't allow me to love. Now it wants, now it allows me to love. How does YouTube know I'm going live? 
How does YouTube know I'm going live? Uh, uh, through, or no, how, I mean, sorry, I'm sorry. No, yeah, how do they know that I'm actually making a video right now? Like, because it was not allowing me to love this. I'd go back, I'd clear out, I'd go like this, and it would be off. Now it wants to be on. So now I look crazy, but... Um, I love you. I'm going to leave a link in the description of the Kofefe and what I think Kofefe means. I love you guys. Born a Hawkeye,